Hello, everyone. This is coadb.com, or the Coat of Arms database. And today we're briefly going to discuss 12 coats of arms in the Bailey family. The first is blazoned per pale azure and sable, a cross crosslet satire wise between four estoils or crest, a cubit arm erect vested bendy of six azure and sable cuff argent, the hand proper holding a crozier and surmounted by an estoil both or. And this coat of arms was from Norwich or Norfolk, England. Next we have Ermino, Erminoi, a lion passant sable holding in the dexter paw a cross patty fitchy gules on a chief nebulae of the second a cross patty or crest in front of a demi lion Ermino holding in the dexter paw a cross patty fitchy gules. This coat of arms was recorded in Igtham Place and Nepaker House, Kent, England. And some further research suggests that this was the coat of arms granted to or, or, born, or born by Reverend James Sanford Bailey, who died in 1909. Next we have Ermine Three Bars Sable, Three Bars Wavy Sable, Crest, a demi lady holding on her dexter hand a tower, in her sinister hand a laurel branch vert. This was the coat of arms uh, borne by Richard Bailey of Rowley, Massachusetts, who came in the year 1630. The brother of James and the father of Joseph, thought to have come from Yorkshire. Whether or not he was truly entitled to bear these arms, I do not no, but he is stated as having borne them in croziers. Next we have Argent between two bars, three annulets in fescules, all between as many martlets of the last. Crest, a griffin sagent argent semi of annulets gules. This was the coat of arms of the baronets of Glanis Park in Brecon, Wales. This was the coat of arms of Sir Joseph Bailey, the first baronet who was born in 1783, and he was an iron master and a member of parliament. Next we have gules on a fess nebulae between four martlets, three in chief, and one in base argent, two roses of the first barbed and seated proper. Crest in front of an anchor in bend sinister proper, a female figure vested vert, supporting with the right hand an escutcheon gules charged with a martlet argent and resting with the left on the stock of the anchor. This coat of arms was recorded in Stratford, County Lancaster, England, and it belonged to John Eagleton. Eglinton Bailey, who was born in 1840. He was an English antiquary, secretary of the Cheatham Society, and fellow of the Society of Antiquaries. Next we have Azure with a hard oar, surmounted by a crosslet of the same, a chief gules charged with three East Oils oar. This coat of arms was from Provence, France, and belonged to a member or family of the bourgeois of de la Cadira. Next, we have Argent, three boars, heads, sable, tusked of the field. Again, this was from Provence, France, de sign at de Vernier, 1696. Looks like perhaps this was the coat of arms of some brothers or some fathers and sons named Jean Antoine Bailey, who was a solicitor, 
Antoine, who was a member of the middle, the upper middle class, and Joseph, who was a merchant. Next, or a fess wavy azure between two lions passant garden sable. This coat of arms was granted in 1578 to an individual of this surname living in Yorkshire, England. Next, we have Sable, the sun in his splendor between five stars, two, two, and one. Argent in middle chief and eagle's head erased or crest. On the point of a sword erected proper, hilted and pommeled or on a laurel wreath fruit of the first. Information, this coat of arms was from Cairn Bray in Lanark, Scotland, granted in 1780, to Matthew Bailey, a physician, the son of Professor Reverend James Bailey, and his wife, Dorothy Hunter. And here we see an actual copy of the grants or the letters patent. And this was auctioned off on the internet several years ago. Next we have Azure, nine stars, three, three, and one Argent, a border or charged with 10 sinky foils vert, crest, a cat sagent proper. Information, this was the coat of arms of William Bailey of Rose Hall in County Sutherland, who was the son of Alexander Bailey of Dotchfuer and this coat of arms was born or granted in 1747. Next we have quarterly, first and fourth, azure, nine stars, three, three, two, and one, or a border counter nebulae, argent and sable, second and third, a lion rampant and in chief, three stars, argent. The Bailey Baronetcy of Pulkey Metz in the county of Linlithgow was created in the baronetage of the United Kingdom on November 14th, 1823 for William Bailey. He was the son of William Bailey, Lord Pulkey Metz, and a Lord of the Session, and the baronetcy is currently on its eighth baronet. Next, Azure. Nine estoils, three, three, two, and one argent. Crest, a boar's head erased proper. This was the coat of arms of Sir Edward Bailey, the first baronet who was born in 1684, the son of Nicholas and the grandson of Lewis, who was an Irish landowner and sat in the House of Commons. And here we see the family seat. If you enjoyed this video, please visit coadb.com and click on the link up top that says Genealogy Research. As you learned in this video, one surname can have tons of different coats of arms associated with it. So don't just pick any old coats of arm that has your surname on it. We piece together your family tree to determine which if any coat of arms belonged to your ancestors. Thank you.